Hello, welcome back to the Cozy Realm, and if you are new here, then welcome to the channel. So today we are playing Trust No One, which is a detective adventure game. I am a journalist managing a. I am a journalist managing the digital. I am a journalist managing. I am a journalist managing the digital news section in the local newspaper. Recently, I received an anonymous letter via paper mail. It's been a while since I last received a paper letter. Okay, so we have a letter. I cannot reveal who I am and where I work right now, but the company I am employed with is developing technology that could significantly impact our world if misused. I fear for my life and I suspect that I am being watched, so I want to ensure my safety by making this information public. I am willing to share everything in person. It's risky to trust such information even to paper, let alone modern means of communication. If you, if you as a journalist find this intriguing, Meet me at the Kiev railway station on October 25th, 2021 at 22. I'm surprised they put the year on there. You will recognise me by the green hat with a pom-pom. Okie dokie. So an elf. And um, we've got some numbers here. I don't know if that's important yet. While this may seem strange, I'm not in a position to miss the opportunity to write about something more interesting than the latest phone model. So I am heading to Kiev for a meeting with a stranger. I think that's how I pronounce that, by the way. However, there is one problem. My contact did not show up. Uh-oh. Don't trust no one. Oh, this is cool. Alright, so... Lockers with loads of numbers. There's a jacket up there. I think it's kind of limited so I can press the stuff that's glowy, but not the stuff that's not. So we have our little inventory up here. I think that's a letter. So maybe 84451. Let's try that. Eight, four. Oh wait, no, that's a locker number. Doi. Okay, one second. Okay, there's a taxi right there. I think we can just take that straight away. Just gonna have a look around just in case. I like the music in the background. It's not really music, but it's nice sound. Better than silence. Okay. <laughs> Is that loads of different people with the same name? All right, I can't call anyone. I don't have any coin. Let's press on the taxi and see what happens. Ah, there's a code to everything! In the back of a taxi's driving seat. Oh, okay. Let's go to the Mustafa system! I know that's not how you spell it, but... Star Wars! Oh my gosh. Okay. Start right, I just went to the most random place I could find. Locked, okay. Locked doors. Spooky. Alright, I, th I think this is all locked at the moment. Oh wait, what did they say? Meet me at the railway station. Okay, so let's see if we can do that. Nope, that's not what I wanted. We don't want an I. We need a K, because this place is spooky. Hopefully I have coin to pay for this. Uh, okay, it's not on here. I don't know where to go. It's all... I think I'm in... yeah, I'm in Russia. I'm somewhere in Russia, just travelling around in my taxi. Let's go for A. Uh, was that the name that was in the book? I have no idea. <laughs> okay, at this rate, I'm going to be going to every single address. How do I get back to the one I was at? I don't know where I was. Okay, this is different. Oh no, I don't know how to get back. Okay, wait, let me uh, see if I can restart. New game, let's go. So we met with a stranger at the station, but they did not show up. What could it mean? So let's do 84. Okay, and then 451. Yes, accepted. All right, cool. So 84 is open. And we have a bit of letter. Trust no one. Way ahead of you there. I foresaw that I might be unable to make it to the meeting, so I am leaving instructions on how to find me. I'm Mazapi11, but if I'm not there, I will hide the key in a secret place. I think you'll figure it out. I think you'll figure it... I think you'll figure it out where. Code message. 14, 2, 4, 1, 2, 6, and 8. Okay. Alright, I know what to do with this. I know what to do. Kinda. 
Okay, so I literally translated this, and it means, I think, therefore I am. It was a quote from the dude, René Descartes, um, and a 14, and a little box, and then some, like, coordinates or whatever this is. I'm gonna go on a really slim thing that probably is not gonna work whatsoever. Uh, okay, yeah, there's no René here. I don't know, I don't know. Let's see where we go. Okay, we go, we're back here. This is not where we want to be. Okay, uh, what was the second name? It was D. D, 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 D. Yes, it's right here. Okay, and then a 14. We have a 14. So let's see if this is the right thing. Okay, it's new. Looks like the Sally Face building. <laughs> what am I supposed to do here, though? Hello? Is anyone here? It's kind of spooky. And that looks a bit like an outline of someone, but it's probably just the curtain. Um, okay. There's gotta be something I'm not seeing here. Okay, I'm just gonna keep going back between this side. That's P11, but if I'm not there, I will hide the key in a secret place. I think you'll figure it out where. And this is the location. And then this is something. Also, this handwriting is kind of like mine or how mine used to be in school. <laughs> it's kind of weird. Anyway, uh, <laughs> I'm trying to think. Okay, let's not look at this and let's see what the thing, maybe it's these. Oh, there's a, there's a brick right here. I see you, sneaky brick. So maybe that's a brick, that's supposed to be a brick. This guy was not very helpful with his secret, secret play. So two across. So two right and four up, so then it was one there and then two up again, so this one and then one, two, three, four, five, six and eight downwards, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ooh, it glowed a bit. I could have just went like this on the whole wall and maybe it could have led me to it if I saw it. Or maybe not, I don't know. Okay, here we are. Here's the brick in the wall. And we got a key! <laughs> Yay! Did we really need to do that all for a key? It's got to be definitely important then if they're hiding something this important. Now we can go to Mazapi. And it was 11. Yes, let's go right there. So now we can use the key on this door. Okay, do I actually have to... There we go! Yay! <laughs> Thank you for playing Trust No One. Full version is available on the PlayStation Store. Okay, great. <laughs> we did all of that to find out what the key, where the key was. And we got it. And we unlocked the place. I'm interested because it's like secretive and saying not to trust no one. So I'm even more intrigued of what it is. But I hope it's not like a massive disappointment where you think it's going to be something major and then you just find out it's nothing. Like, this is the key that you found from doing all of that stuff just to get to his apartment and there's just, I don't know, a fridge magnet and then you have to go somewhere else, which makes no sense. And maybe the big hidden secret is just like, I don't know, some conspiracy or something. But anyways, I really enjoyed it. Yeah, surprisingly, it is actually very puzzling. I do love puzzle games and usually I figure out stuff too easily, so... It's good to have something that actually does, like, pick your brain, kinda. If you enjoyed it as well, do let me know, and let me know if you would like to see the full version. So, yeah, as always, thank you so much for watching, I hope you have a great day or night wherever you may be, and I will see you next time wherever I may be. Bye!